at-home dental emergencies for your teeth. While this is something people may not think of, it certainly is important to know, especially when days like last night where you're stuck in during the storm or that's whatnot, right. you might have to miss an appointment, which was a case for you, Dr. Yes, Lee. yes, that's what made me think about uh, the topic for today because we had a lady call in with a toothache, but she couldn't get to the office. And you know, she was 40 miles away, and we didn't know what the weather was going to no. do. And so we started talking through what was going on, and it made me think of, oh, my God. Gosh, let's talk about some at-home dental emergency Having uh, your care. Having own kit with all exactly. the necessities, but we can't leave out this lovely photo. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> if you're going to be stuck inside and you're feeling that pain, you better be prepared to at least relieve that. That's exactly right. Okay, well, so some of the things, of course, you would think people would naturally think of, but they don't always, is to gently brush, gently brush. Gently brush. And floss. And floss. Sometimes it's as simple as a piece of popcorn kernel or a piece of chip or something like that wedged into the gum that's creating pressure. Okay. And so um, a lot of times it can be something like that that will really help take away the pressure and then the pain. This is so great, this little tool right here. It's um, a little uh, proxy brush is what it's called so this little bitty brush can get in little corners or edges if you've got a piece of tooth fractured off and you need to get some the piece off or right. a piece of the food that's stuck in there or something like that that works great if you have a tooth that's actually knocked out in an accident uh oh <laughs> you want to put it, you want to save it. Your kids are running around. Exactly. And, <laughs> and actually, children, sometimes you can actually replant the tooth okay. and it will grow back to the bone and save it. So it's very good. Plus, it lets the doctor see how much tooth is missing. Nice. Um, this, oh, go ahead. No, I, well, we're going to go to this one eventually. I'm kind of fascinated what we have here. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But let's talk about this one. This looks like putty. And it's called Dentemp, and it, you get it, it even oh comes gosh, with a little tool. Yeah, like yeah, you can feel of it. It's okay. well, and so it's great to use. No, let's go down here. <laughs> All right. It's great to use if you have a hole in your tooth, okay. because the tooth is broken, a cavity starting to bother you, or a crown or a temporary crown's off. You get just a little Literally bit. Literally just fills in. Mm -hmm. that, and saliva actually activates it, so it'll stay kind of putty form until the saliva gets to it, and then it'll harden. Got more. it. So it works great. And you can use your finger, your thumb, to kind of push it in place. Okay, Another one. your own, okay. Um, orthodontic wax, and a lot of people that have had kids have this on hand anyway. Um, Matthew is saying you remember I, that. When I used to have <laughs> braces, I used to have to put this on. Right, so it can cover an edge and help protect it. It can fill in a hole, and you can even put a little dot on it and push a temporary crown or a crown to place. And uh, particularly if you have a hole in front, then it kind of reflects the light. So it's it almost looks, resembles the little putty one. Exactly. Just a little, little more tooth colored. So <laughs> that's a good thing. Okay, then this little uh, puffy yeah. thing. Okay, so that is a cold compress. So okay. it doesn't necessarily have to be this fancy. It could be ice wrapped in a rag. Right. Um, you want to put it on the outside of your cheek, particularly if it's trying to swell. And it'll also bring the uh, blood flow to the area to help create, um, help protect against the inflammation. It. So it will help some of the pain. So, so in all case of you are stuck in and you're swollen, your mm -hmm. gums, your jaw, all that and stuff. And then warm salt water sounds like, you know, an <laughs> old remedy <laughs> that actually works and it helps some of the swelling and inflammation hey, around I'm the gums. I'm sure it really does. Yeah. Make sure to get some good toothpaste. While That's we're right. <laughs> Sensitive tooth toothpaste helps as <laughs> That's well. That's all that matters. <laughs> yeah. Dr. Christie, thank you so much thank again. Thank you. You never know, you might need some of these. That's all right. right. <laughs> you can make your appointment at Abilene Dental today. Just call the number on your screen or head to their offices off Buffalo Gap Road. Check them out on Facebook and Twitter. Just search Abilene Dental. Uh, yeah, when you want more information, don't go away. We'll have